TV here with the latest news of sports. We got some breaking news coming out of the NFL. Urban Meyer is out of Jacksonville's coach despite being with the franchise for less than a season. ESPN's Adam Schefter was the first to report the news Wednesday night, and Jaguars owner Shad Khan soon released a statement to confirm the dismissal. After deliberation over many weeks and a thorough analysis of the entirety of Urban's tenure with our team, I am bitterly disappointed to arrive at the conclusion that our immediate change is imperative for everyone. As I stated in October, regaining our trust and respect was essential. Regrettably, it did not happen. The Jaguars have accumulated a 2-11 record this campaign under his tenure. Their only wins coming from the Bills and Dolphins. Myers' time with the franchise has been filled with drama, making headlines for his conduct both on and off the field. I had planned on doing a video on like, Things that Urban Meyer has done since he's been the head coach for the Jacksonville Jaguars. I wake up this morning and I get the news that he's fired. So we still gonna talk about them things that led to him get fired. But before we do that, I was talking to my brother-in-law. I was telling him like, man, in the next couple of weeks, they gonna get rid of Urban. I was like, he's just doing too much. You know what I'm saying? We've heard more about Urban Meyer than we have about the team in general or just Trevor Lawrence, you know what I'm saying? This is supposed to be the guy, the leader of the locker room, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, like, man, like, you've been on ESPN and TV more than the whole organization. I just feel like Urban Meyer was becoming too much of a distraction. So now we're going to talk about the things that led to Urban Meyer's dismissal. January 14th, 2021, the Jaguars hired Urban Meyer. That's your first mistake right there. February 11th, 2021, Meyer hires former Iowa strength and conditioning coach, Chris Doyle, who was placed on leave in 2020 after he directed racist language at his players. Meyer defended the team's decision to hire Doyle. I vividly remember when this came out because social media like really was like, Urban, what you got going on, bro? And you know, I believe the guy was fired like soon after that too. So February 12th, 2021, Doyle resigns from the Jaguars. Oh, so it was the next day. Wow, that's crazy. Doyle resigns from the Jaguars, citing that he became a distraction for the team. April 29th, 2021, Jaguars agreed to try out Tim Tebow nearly three months after his retirement from minor league baseball. Tebow was Myers quarterback during their time together at Florida but he is planning to play the tight end position at, for the first time at age 33. I already knew this one ain't gonna work out. You have an old coach that's looking out for his favorite player. That's all essentially that is. So there's plenty of tight ends that, you know, could have been brought in for that position. May 10, 2021, Meyer and the Jags signed Tebow to a one-year deal. July 1st, 2021, the Jaguars are fired 200K and Meyer is personally fined 100K after the team violated the non-contact rule during OTAs in the previous months. August 17, 2021, Tim Tebow is released by the Jaguars among their first five roster cuts of the 2021 NFL offseason. Meyer calls the decision tough. Now, what was tough about that? If y'all seen that man Tebow out there in that preseason game, it wasn't that tough about that. August 26, 2021, reports emerged that Jaguars players are in thrill with Myers' coaching style out the gate. August 31st, 2021, Myers says that vaccination status was certainly in consideration when the Jags were making their final roster cuts. Y'all, the season ain't even started yet. And we, I, I don't say it all. I don't riddled all this to you, and, this, and the season ain't even started yet. September 12, 2021, Jason Confor reports that Urban Meyer's unhinged coaching style is already causing issues within the Jaguars coaching staff and locker room. October 1, 2021, the Jags blow a 14-0 first half lead against the Bengals and lose 24-21 on the road. Meyer doesn't fly home with the team after the Thursday night game. 
He stays in Ohio and travels from Cincinnati to Columbus to visit his family during the mini buy. October 2nd, 2021, a raunchy video of Urban Meyer dancing with a younger woman at an Ohio bar goes viral. Meyer has been married to his wife, Shelly, since 1986. October 4, 2021, Meyer apologizes to his team for being a distraction. He says his actions were just- Distraction is stupid. Um, and so I explained everything that happened and owned it and, you know, just stupid. Uh, should not have myself in that kind of position. Did you, did you fly back with the team? No, I stayed to see the grandkids and we all went to dinner that night at the restaurant and then there's a big group next to our restaurant and they wanted me to come over and take pictures and I did. December 11, 2021, NFL Network Tom Pelissaro drops a voluntary report about Myers, the Jags, and reports tension boiling over. December 12, 2021, Meyer denies report after the loss to the Titans. He also vows during the post-game news conference to immediately fire any Jaguars employee who leaks information. Her article basically reported that, you know, Urban Meyer was basically in his coach's face telling him, you know, basically saying that their resume wasn't as great as his. I believe they also said that Urban Meyer like called his assistant coaches like losing. To get up there in a press conference and, you know, say if we got any leakers, then we gonna fire him. If it wasn't true, you wouldn't give me that energy that you gave it, you know what I'm saying? So, like I said, this timeline leads to, you know, his firing. Yesterday, December 15th, former Jaguars kicker Josh Lambeau tells the Tampa Bay Times that Meyer kicked him in the leg at practice last August before the team's preseason finale against the Cowboys. Lambeau says he immediately told Meyer to never do that again, but Meyer instantly dismissed the request, supposedly saying, I'm the head ball coach. I'll kick you whenever the fuck I want. December 16, 2021, Myers fired as Jags coach, 13 games in his tenure. Team owner Shad Cohn announced the dismissal hours after Lambo report was published. That's the season with the Jags and Urban Meyer. And I was literally telling my brother-in-law this. I was talking to a couple of the guys. I'm like, look, man, Urban Meyer ain't gonna make it to the end of the year. Every day, every other week, this man in the news for something. And it'll just be him. They won't say the Jaguars, Trevor Lawrence. It'll be Urban Meyer. And then whatever situation he in. I remember when that video leaked to him in that bar after going home, after the team lost. They was up 14-0 and they lost. And you got caught dancing in the bar. I just knew it was a wrap after that. I'm like, he ain't gonna make it long. What you guys think the future hold for the Jacksonville Jaguars? Let me know in the comments. That was a crazy one right here, man. Reading reading that timeline, man, that's crazy. Man. That'll be all for today's video. If you still watching, please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the tap the notification bell yeah. as well as it lets you know when I upload the video. Guapo. Yeah, Guapo game we go. Listen. Batwood to the face. face. Bad